Hello and welcome to Slightly Impressive Draw Distance. My name is Griffin. We are playing the World of Warcraft Iron Man Challenge. I'm flying my way over to Thorium Point because that's where we left off. I just remembered that we skipped one of those Viking quests because it looked too dangerous. We're gonna hang out in the Searing Gorge for a little while. If you're new here and don't know what the Iron Man Challenge or the Tin Man Challenge is, it's just like the Iron Man Challenge. If you don't know what the Iron Man Challenge is, well, you should probably go read the rules for one of them. You can read those at wowchallenges.com. But there are rules to make it harder to level. In the Iron Man Challenge, if you die, you have to start over. But I have died and have kept going because this is the Tin Man Challenge. Where I'm going to try not to die again. I don't have a tomato for a punishment for death right now, but I'm not gonna die, so it doesn't matter. I don't need, it, I don't need a tomato. I forgot what I needed to talk to you about, but that's a very nice hat you got there. It's sort of dangerous, a little bit. Welcome to Thorium Point. As overseer, I'm responsible for all of the activities in the Thorium Brotherhood. While that mainly involves mining, smithing, and some minor guard duty, we have later become more of a martial organization out of necessity. Oh. Do I know you, a dwarf? Oh, well, I, I don't know. He listens as you describe what you saw within the flames at Thorium Advance. Yeah, I don't remember what I saw, actually. Sounds like another one of Ragnaros's minions. I don't like the sound of that. Based on this information you have delivered, I believe that one of this Archduke's minions may already have turned its eyes toward Thorium Point. His name is Rashakrak. Oh, I like that one. Rashakrak. And he patrols the lava pools just to our south. He looks like the latent fire elementals that rage nearby. I get precious little time away from Searing Gorge these days. Not even meaning to visit a friend in burning steppies. Steps. I knew somebody once who swore this was pronounced steeps, I think it was. He called it burning steeps. I'm pretty sure it's just steps. For the last several months, but I haven't had a chance. His name is Mouton Flamestar. While he's not a member of the Brotherhood, he's a trusted friend and definitely trustworthy. Well, you send my regards. I mean, I guess. If it's on the way. If I'm going there anyway, I guess. I guess. When Lolo doesn't want want to spill any of his precious ale or get his little dress dirty, I'm calling in. What does that mean? Yep, old Hansel is the dwarf they use to meet out a little bit of justice and a whole lot of pain. Who's Lolo? I mean, this guy's pretty cool. He's got a shiny eyeglass thing. He's got spikes, he's color coordinated, he's got it together. Hansel Heavy Hands. Doing it right. Unfortunately, I can't dish out the beats like I used to. Does that mean rapping? Are you talking about freestyle rapping, sir? Beat boxing? I'm not sure. Due to this here fat finger problem. You see, the climate out here combined with the lack of air pressure makes me fingers expand. They are like gigantic Thursamar blood sausages, they are. You're gonna have to carry me out, out me orders of business and what have you. First on me agenda, pounding the living daylights out of the heavy war golems at the gorge. Get cracking. Okay, so they said Lolo couldn't do his job, so you're gonna do it, but now you can't do it because of the sausage finger problem. So, what, now it's my job? Why does this fall on me? We smith, we smelt, we roast up whatever spider meat we can. Bush chicken if we're lucky. Point is, all of this work means we need lots and lots of fire. Good thing we're smack dab in the middle of fire town. <laughs> of course, the, be the best fire comes from the elementals. You'll find them all over a sear and gorge, but always near lava. Here, take these flasks and use them on the elementals. Oh, did I mention the elementals gotta be alive when you gather your sample? You didn't. Also, he has cool fist weapons. This guy's just really cool. I hope I am as cool as old Fat Fingers here someday. Okay, every time I gather a quest, a new one pops up. Is this just Infinite Quest Town? We used to have more stuff around here. I think there was a spyglass somewhere nearby, along with a smithing tool. I don't know what that is. I'm pretty certain they've been stolen by Dark Iron Dwarves. 
Yes, I know that I am a dark iron dwarf. I'm talking about the bad ones that live down in that gorge. You'd best check the steam smiths that work just south of here. They'd be most likely to use tools like these. I don't, I've never quested here. Somehow I completely skipped all of these, like, higher level dwarf zones. Are you Lolo? There, here's Lolo. La 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 lo lo. He is a drinker, I guess. And has sunglasses. <laughs> Lolo is pretty cool. I like the green spot on his head. Normal sized spiders I can handle. Giant glass web spiders make me uncomfortable with them. If they're far enough away that I don't worry too much. But lava spiders, ugh, lava spiders are scary. They're enormous spiders. They live in lava. I agree. Now you just got paid for my last week of work and I'll pay you well to kill those things. You'll find them all over Siren Gorge. Okay, Lolo. La 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 Lolo. Here we go. Alright, I don't know. Oh, no, that's just some elemental. I don't know if I can use my flask on this guy. Let's try it. He's a 47. Just go up here and just pour something on him. There we go. Yeah, it worked. Oh, okay. It makes them tinier. Very nice. Boom. Haha. -ha. I made your small. He is small. Okay, that's the guy I need to kill. He's not an elite, so I think I can handle him. Let's go get him. I'm gonna get you. <laughs> Taking my disappearing horse over there. Excuse me. Where is he going? What? You got some date or something? Okay, the flask works on him. Great. Alright. I feel like he was just scared of me. He was like, oh, <laughs> he probably has a quest to kill me. I'm getting out of here. Alright, I like this. We've got a nice, densely packed quest objective area. This is good. Perfect for a Tin Man challenge. What? Hey, Lunk. What? Where did you come from? What you doing? Why you kill? You need to get things from dwarfs? Ah, uh, Lunk understand. Lunk have a better way. Listen, you go fight dwarf, but do not kill. Just fight until dwarf get tired. Then Lunk will help dwarf fall asleep. Dwarfs probably just crank it because they don't get sleep. Come on, trust Lunk. Okay, I believe you. Let's go put them to nap time. Okay, it's lights out for you. Time for a nap, son. Okay, Lunk. Uh, Lunk is definitely just sitting on them. Did you get loot? Because I need to get loot from them, too. Not just... Okay, he disappeared, but he still has the Zs. I don't... <laughs> A little confused about this quest. Lunk, I'm not sure you thought this through super well. He's not gonna sit on them, is he? Hey, 51. Don't kill him, I need to flask him. Okay. Oh, that's true. That's true. Good thinking there, uh, Sir Noble. He doesn't want to sit on them because they're on fire. Don't sit on people who are on fire. Excellent advice from Twitch chat. Okay, uh, Lonk, you weren't quite on the ball there with that one. Uh, definitely killed him, but look, I needed that spyglass anyway, so it worked out. Just, he doesn't seem to have noticed. Just, shh, nobody tell Lonk. Nobody tell him I killed that guy. Goodbye, Lonk. Thanks for your help, sort of. You're a good lad, Yar. I got you a little present for your troubles. Great, some fat finger gloves I can't wear. Thanks so much. Oil Fist says he's gonna have us making firebomb soon. All the more need for those flasks. Ye ouch! Don't just go putting this stuff into a dwarf's open hand. The stuff is burning up. Now my hands are gonna get even more swollen. There's no way you could have killed all the spiders in the gorge, but you definitely made a dent. Fine, here's what I promised you. Don't spend it all in one place. Unless it's a Thorium point. <laughs> As acting taskmaster of this here compound, it's my duty to make sure that there is a certain level of tedium involved with all forms of business, work, rest, and relaxation that may take place here. Why? If you find anything that you are asked to do to be too easy and hassle-free, report to me immediately. If you're here for the reward, you're going to have to give me the stolen goods. 
All right, here's here you go. Have you seen the ridiculous necklaces those Twilight Hammer caught this year? Oh, the gems on those things are bigger than Hansel's fist. A few hamburger-sized jewels like that and burn innate. Over there could really push this blacksmithing business to the next level. Who's burning, Nate? Fetch those collars and he'll make it worth your while. I won't fight any elementals until we have proven that they pose a threat to us. It is unfor- Well, if they didn't before, they probably do now because I went and killed a bunch of them. It is unfortunately as I expected. These bracers bear the indelible mark of the Fire Lord and his minions. Very well, with no horde or alliance forces anywhere near this godforsaken gorge, it falls upon the Thorium Brotherhood to stop this Archduke before he spreads any more of his evil. I got one more assignment for you. This one comes straight down from the Overseer himself. It seems he was pretty shook up once he heard about the Archduke you discovered. He's asked us to hunt down three Twilight Ministers that work over in Firewatch Ridge. Ridge, I mean. Uh, to the west. Kiyurbi, Lethirio, and Finister are their names, and they each carry some sort of special rock. Combine all three and bring them back here. Okay. Listen, when the Overseer gives orders, you don't ask questions. You just do it. That's not true of me. I ask questions about everything. I just shout them into the void. Uh, this looks dangerous. We got a lot of them in a tight space. Okay. Do I have a ranged silence? I can't remember. Oh, oh, Avenger Sealed is a si shield is a silence. Yeah, right. Okay, we discussed that last time. Whoops. All right, I'll just cool down. That wasn't bad at all. They're pushovers. Bunch of dress wearing pushovers. Will you assist me, mortal? Hear my tale. Uh, okay, if it's fast. I mean, these guys are gonna respawn. Praise the loon, it has been many years since I have had visitors. I, are you a ghost? I, what are you? As a young night elf in Darkshore, I crossed paths with a group of unsavory individuals known as the Twilight's Hammer Man. A group of them befriended me, and shamefully I ended up eschewing my faith in a loon and embracing the vitriol of the Twilight Hammer. It was not until a vision came to me from a loon that I got woke up from the malaise that I had fallen into as a father of the old god man. In repentance, I began work on my prayer to a loon. Etched into a tablet- That is so much talking. Okay, let's paraphrase. He wants something about a tablet. You were executed. Wow, okay. I have accepted my fate here in this cage, but the prayer must be found, man. Will you assist me, mortal? Will you find the prayer to a loon? Yeah. Alright, I'll go find your tablet. Whoa, what is this guy up to? I really like these hats on goblins. They look like little witchy Jawas. Oh. Well, that's nice. I guess we freed his soul or whatever from that cage. I, I don't know. Do I have rocks? I'm getting rocks, right? Kaiyubi's thing. Okay, yeah. So we've killed two of them. I wonder if the layout of this cave... Okay, we can't see it. I don't know where the other guy is. There's no Finister up here. It was all a lie. Are you a Finister? Oh, there's that's Finister. Okay. Let's not pull the whole place. The goblin in the fancy hat. Well, didn't I already kill him like three times? How did I not get his orb? Stupid little goblin. Was that some other? No, I definitely killed this guy already. He was standing in this little circle and everything. Oh, I already have it. Oh, it was down here. Oh, jeez. All right, let's combine these. Wow, what a waste of time. Stupid Fenister, I killed him like four times. The Thorium Brotherhood doesn't maintain a militia. Just a few guards and me and that's it. If we're to successfully strike against the dark irons of the guards, we're gonna need help. Mountain Lord Rendon sits atop that tower across the gorge to our south. He doesn't consort with the Twilight folks, the Fire Elementals, but he hasn't joined the Brotherhood either. Maybe it's time we paid him a visit. With his help, we might just stand a chance. Oh, These are neutral? Okay, I gotta make sure I don't hit them. Jeez. I don't like that. You got a bunch of high-level neutrals hanging out here. And who might you be? I like this guy's hat. It's fancy. He looks like 
or Robin Hood or something. Ah, an emissary from Thorium Brotherhood. They're looking for my support? Fine, I might be willing to help out. Well, that was easy. For a price. Oh, never mind. The Dark Irons and Blackrock have got nothing on me. Neither are these boys up at Thorium Point. I'm independent as can be, and that's the way I like it. Of course, for the right price, I'll listen to either side. Oh, you got three quests for me? That overseer oil fist couldn't pick... Couldn't have picked hours time to ask me to join a fight. My summit's are already under siege. It's nothing my guards can't handle, but still, it won't be easy for me just to pick up and send some dwarves into that infernal gorge. Why didn't he have me just, like, fly back to Ironforge? And be like, hey, they need some help if you want to send some army people. Tell you what, you take out their marksmen that they're holding out a fortress under siege, and I'll reconsider your offer. You don't find them slinking around the flats to the east. Good. Okay. Got it. Uh, yep. All right. Set them ablaze. What do you want me to do? Let's paraphrase here. Uh, you want me to set oh, some bitch. towers on fire? Okay, got it. And get a couple hundred bullets from them? Okay. Good. I gotta get a quest from just some lady standing over here by some boxes. Oh, are she is looking mean. There's so much we don't know about the incendiosaurs. Where did they come from? How did they survive out here in the flats? And why do they taste so bad? <laughs> the key to understanding these prehistoric beasts, I believe, starts with the fire gizzard. Every incendiosaur has one. I'd like a few of them to study. You'll find incendiosaurs uh, circling in the foot of the iron summit, mostly to the west. Okay, there's just boxes of bullets just sitting around everywhere unattended. Fantastic. I need your fire gizzard, nothing personal. Thank you. I remember it used to really bother me that everybody called their characters toons. I was like, it's not a cartoon, it's a video game. It's not even cartoon look like, I guess it's kind of cartoony. But it's not 2D like a cartoon. <laughs> Why does everybody call them toons? And now I just, I just do it like everybody else. Did you say I had to go to a brazier? Yeah, okay. Well, what? I'm going to set it on fire while I'm in it? Great plan, genius. The Dark Irons and Blackrock have got nothing on me. Neither are those boys up at Thorium Point. Okay, yeah, you already told me that. If nothing else, you brought us some time, bought us some time and some room to open up our supply lines through this siege. You're a fine paladin. Oh, thank you. The Dark Irons and Black... Okay, I know, I know they've got nothing on you. I know, bro, I know. A real paladin would have caught the bullets with his teeth. You just said it was a fine paladin. What? Come on. Make up your mind. I'll just divvy these up amongst the guards. You have my thanks. Off with you. Well, you are welcome. Oh yeah, 52? Alright, I said at level 52 I was going to go back and try that quest. So I guess I should do that now. Let's finish up this area. There's a lot going on here. Finally, getting my hands on those lizard gizzards. Oh, these are nice. Now leave me alone with my gizzards. I've got studying to do. Starts to poke the gizzards with a stick. Yes, very interesting. Very interesting indeed. Keep your feet on the ground. <laughs> I like her. Agnes Flimshale. Whoa, you have a really dangerous little ledge here, dude. Looks like you know how to light things on fire. Oh, yeah. An admirable trait in any dwarf, I'm sure. What? Why are you still here? Oh, did I promise I'd help you and the Thorium Brotherhood in your fight? I lied. Oh, really? I can't just can't spare them in right now. I know I said I'd help, but there's absolutely no way you can convince me to leave Iron Summit right now. Absolutely no way. Oh, hi. How are you going to convince him? <laughs> Why is the Lunk just dancing out here? Well, 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 look who comes searching for Lunk this time. This sounds like case for Lunk's unique brand. I like how he doesn't, he has terrible grammar, but he knows the word unique. Unique brand of no kill problem solve. All right, we're gonna find dwarves who like to dance to try to convince this guy to help us in a war. This seems like a real thing for sure. How am I gonna talk to these guys with, a, I can't right click them, I'll start hitting them. They're attackable. What do I do? Okay, I'm probably overthinking this. Here they are. Okay, 
Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Let me talk to them. I didn't hit him. A little busy here, Paladin. What do you want? Want to dance with us? He's like, oh, yeah. Of course I do. <laughs> Filled up a three dwarf conga line. Okay. What's on your mind? This is so weird. Okay, we got a conga line going. <laughs> All right, look at this. Look, where did they go? Where's my conga line? Okay, come on, man. Come on. Here we go. Da 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 da. I like how these guys are dancing. Da 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 da. Do da da. Oh, I'm dancing too. Do da da do 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 do. What's on your mind? Did I, Doctor? I believe I clearly said that I won't. Wow, you got some good moves there. I'm impressed. Yeah, you are. All right, all right. If I knew you could dance like that, I wouldn't ask you to do all that stuff earlier. <laughs> Tell Overseer Oilfish that I'll be joining ya. I'll meet you in the slag pit, lad. With the combined forces of of Thorium Point and Iron Summit, those gorgeous dwarfs won't know what hit him. Alright, that quest was pretty great. I really like Lunk. He adds so much fun to all these zones. I had no idea these zones were so fun. They seem so boring and drab. Let's go do that quest that we skipped, because I'm a little beefier now. And it's green now. Alright, here we go with my Viking pals. We're gonna do this. There he is. Uh, level 47 elite. Uh, I mean, I've got these guys. I need to actually use them, I think. Okay, here we go. Here's my moment. Dun dun dun. 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 This is not hard at all. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That was nothing. I didn't even need my Viking friends. <laughs> Alright, cool. Whatever. We got it. Done. Now I just need to kill one more of these guys. Wow. Can't believe I was worried about that. What? I have to go in the Horde Town? Are you crazy? Why would I do that? Okay, I'm very wary here. There better not be any high-level guards. Alright, well... Oh, biting off a lot here. Okay. Uh, let's buff everybody up here. There we go. Oh, that was nothing. Oh, I forgot. I'm like way over leveled for this. Okay. Okay. Get him. Oh, he's a little tougher than the dragon. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Oh, ah, ah, what happened? What happened to me? Ah. Okay, got him. That was fun. I kind of like this. I feel like we're just storming the place. I've got my little squadron. Am I going? Yeah, I need to get down and go around, right? Okay. Don't want to pull a bunch of aggro here. What just happened to me? Level 40. What killed me? What just happened? New Karga Defender. Shoot. Hit. What is going on? These guys keep spawning. Hit you 6,000 physical. New Karga Defender. Ah, uh, now I gotta eat a tomato. Ah, oh, jeez. Oh, it's this guy. Oh, he shot me. See, I knew this was gonna be a problem. Duh, I knew going up here was going to be a problem. I knew it. Man, that's what I said. It was a horde area. That's why I didn't want to go here. That sucks. I'm mad. I'm mad about that. Huh. Okay, so the next stream, I'll eat a tomato. Okay, where are we going to sleep this time? Let's sleep behind these mannequins. Nobody will even know I was here. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time. Okay, bye. <coughs>